Hey, Eric. So let's get started. So uh, the topic for today's session is uh, Apache Local Community, Present and Beyond. And thank you so much, everyone, for joining. And welcome to ApacheCon. So, uh, so uh, I will start with my introduction. So I'm Swapnil Ammane. Uh, I'm currently serving as a vice president at Apache Community Development Project and the member of Apache Software Foundation and Central Services Editorial Team. Apart from that, I'm I'm the founder of uh, Open Source Wave, which works. It's a non-profit initiative, works for spreading of open source awareness. And I'm also the founder and chair of Apache Local Community and PMC member to various Apache projects. And uh, I'm also serving as a developer relations at uh, WebNE. So WebNE is an open source serverless framework to build serverless applications. Uh, so uh, our session outline will be something look like this. We will talk about uh, two things. One is uh, how uh, Apache Local Community is a special idea. What happened is it is uh, it is different from code contribution. So uh, when I proposed this idea and how uh, people engage with it, and this idea flourished, and you can currently see it in. Current way, currently we are having five ALC across the globe. So how this idea started and how, if you have some idea, which is not related to code uh, and how you can project it to the community and how, uh, how you can uh, take it further, we will talk about in this session, the first part. And the second is uh, I will talk about what is ALC and what is our present state and next plan for the Apache local community. So uh, to start with, uh, how did it started? So what happened is uh, in uh, when we were planning something around uh, ApacheCon in India, so it's kind of ApacheCon roadshow, uh, Apache uh, roadshow we were planning for for India. So there I was uh, trying to contact uh, some local people uh, in the region, but were not able to do that. So I thought uh, it will be good to connect with the local people and so that they can collaborate and build something. So this is how I started and on June 26th, I just uh, dropped a mail that, hey, there is some possibility if, if we can uh, build a community, uh, a local community where people can collaborate, share their knowledge uh, uh, and work for spreading up awareness of Apache in the open source. So this was just a, a thought which I put uh, into that. And then on, on top of that, uh, I got some more feedback. Then on uh, from June to August, more feedback was there from the community. Very constructive feedback. Then I put some, what could be the next step? And then on uh, uh, November 19th, we, as a community, we we figure out it could be go under the Apache Comdev project as, as their initiative because it is related to community. And Comdev is a project which took care of all the community development for the uh, Apache Software Foundation. So uh, we, we uh, uh, share and propose that and, and when we, uh, uh, we go through it and then finally uh, the 4th December is important because uh, on this day Rich uh, proposed some good changes to it and basically the good feedback that how we can make sure that the ALC uh, uh, chapter we establish are in line with the Apache philosophy so what whatever they are presenting or communicating outside the, uh, with outside world that should be in line with the Apache Software Foundation so then uh, we got some more uh, uh, thoughts and brainstorm. You can see around 20 people involved in this thread and 38 replies were there. So it's a, it's a good thread, one of my special thread. So uh, so all, all in all, uh, during this uh, 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 discussion, 160 emails were sent on the mailing list, 49 people around involved in the discussion. And we talked about in 12 different topics for over the mailing list. And that's give birth to the Apache local community. So during this process, what I have figured it out is we are not established our only Apache local community. We uh, particularly, uh, I, I figure out the process. If you have some idea and would like to present it to the Apache or it's applicable to uh, uh, all the all the open source community, but uh, uh, we'll take an example of how it, it uh, perfectly fit with the Apache Software Foundation and how, how you can engage with the community and take your idea to, the, uh, to something real and how you can get the feedback and, and, and focus on the constructive communication. So if you have an idea, the first thing is to define and document it. What happened is we came across very idea, various ideas that could be good for the any open source project or particular for any open source community. It's in our head, but as long as it's not properly documented, uh, if you not define the scope of it, uh, uh, really uh, it's difficult for people to help you on that. So first define and document it. And then, 
After this, share it with the community. Uh, it doesn't need to be a perfect uh, uh, fine-tuned document. It's, it should not be at the final stage. Don't worry, community will help you to achieve that state. And then uh, set up an example, right? For example, uh, uh, if, you, if you talk about Apache local community, I, I documented what, what should be the roles and responsibility of the people, how it will look like, how they will operate, how will they organize the event. And then I share it with the community and, and also work, uh, work on setting up examples. So what happened is we established Apache local community indoor and uh, 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 the teammates from the uh, ALC indoor uh, worked really hard to set up and write example that how an ALC should work. And then we, uh, uh, with this example and all, all this stuff, uh, we, we have various multiple discussion with the community and and work on the various feedback and have a constructive communication. So here, feedback is very important. What happens is when you look, when you are doing something, it, it may happen you are looking at it from one perspective. But the great part about the community is we have multiple people with multiple level of experience, also the like life experience as well as the uh, professional experience. So based on that, they 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 have some things to share with you, like means. Hey, we did something like this in the past, but it didn't. It it didn't get. Uh, it it goes not right. It goes uh, wrong for this reason. So if you are doing this, don't uh, don't do this thing. So this kind of suggestion comes, and sometimes it's not always a constructive communication. Sometimes you feel that uh, uh, people may object on something. So no need to offend. It is because they are uh, you both are working for good of the community. It's just that they thought something should not be done in that way. That's why they are they are uh, sharing it with you. Uh, sometimes the issue with the uh, 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 male communication is you can't see the uh, person face and expression. So it might possible that you misunderstood it. So my suggestion and takeaway for, for it is uh, if you find any feedback for your thought, idea, code or anything, take it in a constructive way uh, because everybody is doing here is doing uh, for the community in open source, right? So now work on the feedback and then Whatever is the outcome, share again with the community, get some more feedback, and eventually when uh, everything goes fine, uh, you will find the things in a good place. Same apply for the ALC. As you can see, we uh, more than 50 people, uh, uh, almost 50 people involved in discussion, fine tune, and then what you can see uh, the ALC is look like. So this is the part first of the, uh, uh, for, for the my session. Uh, what I will do is I will take the questions at the end of the session. So if you have any uh, question, uh, please, please be patient with me and uh, I will answer your queries at the end of the session. So uh, probably I will wrapping the sessions around 20, 25 minutes and then we have the remaining time for the questions. So uh, next part, now what is ALC and what is our current descent and what's our future plan? So let's get, let's get started with it. So Apache local community is uh, uh, is, is an Comdev initiative. So what happened is it is uh, uh, it's it's a group of uh, local Apache people or open source enthusiasts, uh, and they are called as the ALC chapter. So for example, you, if you are in a city and you uh, you have some fellow mates of uh, from the Apache Software Foundation, and you are uh, and if you are from Apache, obviously you are enthusiast for the open source. So this particular group is uh, called as ALC chapter. And it is a part of Comdev initiative. So all the uh, roles, responsibility of uh, establishing it, managing it, and uh, making sure that uh, uh, how things are going at ALC, along with the ALC chapter members, it is it is taken care by the uh, Comdev PMC and and uh, the Comdev committers. So it's like a local group of people uh, spreading the awareness of Apache Software Foundation and open source. So. Uh, if you heard of Google Developer Group or Facebook Developer Circle, it is exactly similar to that. Uh, moving on to uh, uh, currently, we have how many uh, ALC is it? currently we have is is number five. So uh, we started with the uh, indoor chapter, then the Beijing, then Warsaw, uh, Poland, then Budapest, Hungary, and then uh, Lagos, Nigeria, and and one more we are planning in 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 uh, China. Hopefully, it will be established uh, uh, soon. So, so uh, currently we have five ALC. So, if you are from a place where we, you don't have an ALC and are willing to spread the awareness of Apache Software Foundation and open source, yeah, there is a chance to apply for it. Cool. So, uh, so let's let's talk about ALC roles and responsibilities. So that if you are planning to uh, 
establish an ALC in, in, in your area or region, uh, what should be things you can take and care and what are the responsibility as an ALC we are, we are having? So uh, first and foremost, spread the awareness of Apache uh, in local communities. So uh, uh, that, that's the prime goal. And it, it, inro it involves spreading the knowledge of open source and how the foundation work, various open source project. It's, it's, a, it's, not, uh, it's not limited to any one thing. The, you can imagine anything that can benefit uh, for the Apache in terms of spreading awareness, go for it. Uh, then uh, how we do it is we host various local events for open source enthusiasts, uh, and we are not uh, uh, we are very open to uh, our audience. So uh, based on our experience in in past two years with the ALCs, we we uh, have multiple uh, types of audience like for students, developer, and also we uh, conducted various events for the business community. Uh, we share the information about ASF, Apache Way, and various Apache projects. And as I mentioned, it's not limited to that. If you if you find something which can be uh, benefited uh, for the audience in terms of Apache, go ahead and and we, we can share the our knowledge on that as well. And what what the best part about it is we we bring together project users and 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 the developer. So uh, so so when when the when the users and developers are, are at one place, there's a definitely a good synergy of trans, uh, transferring the knowledge and, and, and various things that benefited the project. So uh, these are the major roles and responsibility. And, uh, and now let's come to the, uh, what are the benefits of ALC? So uh, when we establish or put the idea of uh, uh, Apache local community, uh, the, this was the main question that if we do that, it will involve a lot of efforts and lots of volunteers are working very hard to make this make the ALC initiative happen, and they are uh, really committed towards it. So, what will be the benefit if we if we put so much of energy into it? So, one of the direct benefit which we we uh, we found is uh, we open the door for very frequent and small events. If we talk about uh, uh, our our main events, which are the Apache Con and the second one is Apache Con uh, uh, Apache Roadshow. Uh, so, uh, the Apache Con and the Roadshow. Uh, are very limited in the number. So what happened is this ALC brings up, opens up door for us to uh, have more frequent and smaller events. So uh, past many, uh, past two years, we, we say uh, we, every ALC do certain kind of smaller events and some major events as well. So that the, that's the uh, first and foremost benefit we get from the ALC initiative. And then uh, uh, another is it, it provides a platform from different different project committer from the same time to meet and exchange idea thoughts and, and, and knowledge. So what happens is uh, uh, if you are in one Apache projects, uh, and if uh, it it may possible that you don't know uh, much from uh, what happening in the uh, another Apache project. There are more than three fifty plus open source project initiative under the Apache umbrella. So there are high rate of possibility that you don't know aware of all the projects, right? So what happened is if you have a committer from the different project in your city, you don't even know them. So what happened is ALC will bring both of the, those committers or the ASA people to the same umbrella and they can exchange thoughts and, and you know, like-minded people when they meet, they can they bring a lot of uh, amazing things. So that's another benefit. And uh, as we have our motto community over code, so the ALC gives direct benefit in building and expanding our community across the globe. So there are some major benefits which, which we, we figure out while we were working on the ALC initiative. Uh, so uh, so this is the important question. If you, if you would like to uh, set up an ALC chapter, what you should be doing? So uh, so this is the this is the questions. Uh, so again, if you are in uh, in in the city or region where uh, where you don't have the ALC. This is something uh, you can help to us to establish that ALC and, and lead it and spread the awareness of ASF and the open source. So uh, what happened is the flow currently look like something like this. Uh, uh, a volunteer request by sending a mail to the dev at the rate community.org. So his subject line is like ALC uh, and request to establish the ALC and the name of your city in the subject line. One thing is we have strictly one ALC per town and city. So uh, before applying, please make sure uh, uh, you check that if, uh, there should not be an already ALC exist in, in, in your region. So if it exists, feel free to join them. And then we have some restrictions around uh, what, what are the mandatory requirements for establishing ALC. So we need one ASF member 
and two PMC members uh, for for an ALC chapter. The reason behind it is uh, they uh, it really helped to understand the uh, what uh, how Apache work and and since we are spreading the awareness of ASF, it, uh, we have to somehow make sure that this the knowledge which we which the chapter is having they are communicating it properly and for that uh, uh, the members and pmc member number help us to making sure that uh, uh, we are in the right path to uh, sharing our knowledge related to apache and the open source so once you send that mail uh, uh, you can on the mail you can say uh, who are the interested people and then uh, you can uh, send the mail and once you start this thread uh, over the dev list it may possible and there are very high chances and and we observe it in the past uh, people from uh, same region uh, shows their interest for joining the ALC chapter. So it's it's really happening. So uh, if you are in a region where you don't know the people who are uh, who you don't know any any other people from ASF would like to uh, join you for the ALC, don't worry. Just share the mail on the uh, dev list and and probably uh, it, it, it there are high chances that people from the same region will will uh, show their interest on the, on this mail. And then what happened is based on this, uh, we uh, took this request to the uh, committee development project management committee. And uh, and there the voting goes on. So they basically look for uh, who are the members which are interested and what are their qualification. And, and majorly in, in, in terms of qualification, like uh, how many people are experienced with the ASF, uh, because it may possible, right? Means uh, uh, some people who, who don't have uh, uh, that much experience with the Apache, but I still would like to initiate the uh, uh, community uh, Apache local community chapter at, at their region. So what what happened is in that terms, uh, uh, people from the community uh, uh, show their interest to uh, give the mentorship to that chapter, and and this is how it started. So after the uh, uh, so PMC discuss various things, and based on what uh, uh, whether this uh, ALC chapter will be established or not uh, is decided. Pretty much common for for uh, the like uh, the voting is very common in, in uh, ASF for for various priority stuffs. So uh, uh, so now uh, once the PMC approve it, the uh, uh, the PMC uh, member will create a chapter space in the community development wiki. So we we are ma managing uh, the stuff in the confluence, and then we have the uh, the official announcement. Hey, this is the new ALC which we have established so that. Uh, the wider audience uh, of the Apache Software Foundation can can know about it. So there are more than uh, more than three thousand plus uh, subscribers to the announce list. Um, when I last checked, there could be uh, more. So they all get aware that hey, the new LC is there, and so if they would like to support or guide or participate, they 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 can do it. Dissolving in a, a self chapter, we uh, personally uh, we don't ever wish to do do this, but yeah, uh, since uh, since. Uh, it's, it's a part of our roles and uh, 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 the how the ALC will operate. So, for example, if if some a ALC is inactive for more than three months, and more importantly, they are no longer interested in this initiative, it may be possible for any reason, right? For example, the the people from that ALC chapter may be relocated somewhere, or uh, or maybe, for example, they don't have enough teams. So, and uh, so as long as if if they explicitly mention that, hey. Uh, we are no longer interested. If they need support, we are always there to support them. But if, if for any reason they show they're uh, they are not interested with it, uh, we we take care of uh, dissolving that particular ALC. And again, the uh, request goes to Comdev PMC. We have discussion and the vote, and then uh, uh, we dissolve it. But the simple reason behind it is because we strictly have one ALC chapter per town and city. So if if, if it is not active. Uh, it, it may blocks the other people to contribute uh, and uh, have the events for the ALC chapter. So this is how we proceed so far. Uh, and now uh, the guidelines. So uh, uh, so every ALC chapter has organized some events. So uh, the thing is, uh, uh, what are the guidelines? Because uh, you can imagine the scale of uh, five ALC so far. Every LC organized some event uh, in a month or so. So in, in past two years, we have a lot of events. So to make sure that the, our messaging is proper and uh, uh, and to help a particular LC chapter to organize an event, we we set up some guidelines. And again, as I discussed as the first part of the session, these guidelines are, and all the inputs are came from the community itself. 
So what happens is if you would like to organize any event, so you set up a detailed agenda of the event, send a mail to Comdev, and request, and and then any PMC member will approve it. Uh, uh, so any Comdev PMC member will approve it, and then the uh, then the event will be executed. Once the event is executed, uh, you share the post event report so that uh, uh, the wider audience get to know that what was the impact of this event. Uh, and it's not necessary that uh, uh, everyone should be very huge and large. It's not necessary. Again, the motto of ALC is to have uh, more frequent events so that we can reach to more uh, more audience. Uh, so it's not necessary that you, you should wait for a big event. Not, not necessary. And then uh, we also maintain the past and upcoming event details on the wiki space. So all the events which are happened in the past and what what we events we are planning. So we maintain all these details in 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 the confluence. So if you are not aware of confluence, it's like an uh, it's a place to manage your documents. Uh, if uh, if you want to understand in simple terms. So uh, so. So basically, uh, Comdev PMC take care of all the ALC chapter and every uh, uh, and 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 uh, and we also have one role uh, and uh, which is ALC chair. So uh, so ALC chair is the uh, primary person and the point of contact for for your all ALC activities. So you you uh, so basically you directly reach for uh, reach for reach to Comdev PMC for any question related to ALC. But if Comdev PMC have uh, something to discuss uh, or uh, to reach out to a person to for any anything, it could be uh, related to anything. So we have a uh, ALC chair who is responsible for uh, filing a quarterly, uh, uh, who who basically ensure that every uh, ALC chapter is uh, filing their report quarterly, uh, and along with PMC, uh, uh, make sure make sure the material and the content used for the events is proper. And if for any reason Comdev PMC uh, go to contact for the ALC uh, things is this ALC share and definitely uh, mentor and guide new ALC. So uh, currently I'm serving as a ALC chair. So, uh, uh, so uh, again, uh, it's it's uh, there's a lot of thing involved in it, in it. And obviously most of the things are taken care of by the Comdev PMC, but there are a few things where we reach out to some people. So uh, so we uh, we we have this ALC chair role where if Comdev has something to discuss for so they reach out to the uh, ALC chair. And now we have Comdev PMC ALC chair and then we have various chapter right. So every chapter have one chapter lead because uh, uh, we need someone to uh, who is the point of contact for for the. Uh, for the ALC, particular ALC chapter. Uh, so there are various roles and responsibility involved for, for an ALC chapter lead, like uh, making sure that ALC coder conduct and followed. Again, it's not only the responsibility of ALC chapter lead, it's just that uh, along with team, uh, uh, chapter lead also has some more responsibility to making sure that these things that are happening. And, and obviously no, no initiative is done by individual person. It's not scalable. So whole ALC team is in in a way responsible for making sure that uh, we are following the code of conduct and making sure we are following we are delivering the right messaging of the Apache. Uh, and and then uh, uh, chapter lead make sure that ALC events are organized as per the guidelines. And as as I mentioned, uh, every uh, uh, chapter reports so or quarterly report to the Comdev. So ch uh, chapter lead uh, submit that report. It's a simple report. What happened in the past quarter? Nothing fancy. Uh, it's it's uh, uh, as as much as detail if you want, would like to involve in that you can write that report uh, and send it to the private list, uh, which is the Comdev PMC list. Uh, so that uh, the, the purpose behind it is uh, uh, so that they can better help you to grow. Uh, so if, if if they found something is not working the way, Comdev PMC can certainly assist you, help you to grow it, and 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 to answer your queries. So that's why this is in place. And uh, it also uh, uh, assure uh, give us assurance that things are going in the right place. As you can imagine, the volume is very, very high, and we have a di diverse community in, in the Apache and the ALC itself, a ALC and the Apache itself. So uh, then, uh, uh, the uh, the major point of contact uh, for the respective ALC chapter is chapter lead. Uh, now we comes uh, the uh, another very really important part of, of the ALC chapter is the chapter members. So chapter members are uh, all the members which are responsible for the uh, that particular ALC chapter. They, they they make sure the code of conduct is followed. 
so uh, we have some uh, code of conduct for the alc which is which is followed and uh, and the events are organized as per the guidelines like uh, if some events is happening it's it's uh, important to share the updates prior to the event to the comda pmc and uh, and share the uh, details uh, you don't have to send that mail on the private list you can share that uh, on on the uh, on the public list of the comdev and so that uh, wider audience can can uh, go to know about the event and if they would like they they can also participate and uh, on that mail uh, somebody from the comdev pmc replied and approved the event uh, so we have various volunteers who who just simply approve approve the uh, alc event so you don't have to wait too longer for for your events to be approved and if they have any question they just simply post and and we need your help to answer those questions and then uh, uh helping uh, preparing the report uh, so yeah chapter mem members collaboratively help the uh, to prepare the reports and uh, uh, so we have the uh, every every chapter has some space in the confluence where we uh, we have uh, where we manage what are the future uh, what are the reports and what are the past and the fu uh, future events so all this uh, is also the responsibility of chapter members to make sure that that, that the document and the resources are up to date coming to the uh, journey so far uh, so currently we have five alc as i mentioned and uh, uh, we have organized more than uh, 30 plus events uh, uh, smaller and, and, and large one one of the uh, uh, highlighting uh, would like to highlight the alc beijing team who uh, played a very important role in, uh, in in executing the apache on asia 2021 so uh, so beijing alc beijing team play a really vital role in it so uh, kudos congratulations thank you so much alc beijing team for your for your hard work in it uh, and uh, we have various uh, all the thirty plus event uh, includes various physical meet up some of them virtual uh, and we have the webinars the podcast and uh, and and the interesting part is we also had some hands on uh, code workshop for the university and the college grades so where uh, various alc members uh, join uh, go to their college and and uh, took some apache project give them some idea of apache project and then uh, make sure they they make their first contribution to the open source and that apache project so this is something we we have done so far and the result has been, uh, has been the uh, exceptionally well so we also uh, worked on some content translation particularly in the metrian language so uh, alc beijing team and some other uh, uh, teams worked on it uh, apart from that uh, alc indo team Warsaw, uh, LC Warsaw, uh, Poland, LC uh, Budapest uh, uh, team, and uh, uh, they really worked very hard in making sure that things are at light place, and we are doing uh, various lot of things for spreading the awareness of ASF and the uh, open source. So lots of amazing stuff we are doing at the at the LC. Uh, so yeah, please join us, men, if you if you have interest in in. Uh, conducting events and and connecting with the local community so please please uh, it's it's a great platform so what's next we are planning uh, currently our all the documents are at at the confluence so we will be establishing our new website which is local.apache.org uh, uh, so we are working on the website it's it's a long pending thing uh, which, which is which is team is currently working and we uh, uh, we reinitiated uh, this uh, effort and hopefully soon you will see this uh, uh, website live and uh, we are working towards establishing the new chapter as i mentioned a new chapter from the china is is in plan and in the discussion uh, and we recently established the lagos uh, nigeria chapter and there are some requests from other regions as well so uh, so establishing new chapter and uh, and making sure that existing chapters are doing uh, uh, if they need any help we we are fl flourishing those as well and again uh, more and more events as uh, currently most of the events are uh, virtual uh, and and yeah some 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 uh, regions are opening uh, for the physical events as well so we are having, having that as well so more and more event to spread the asf and the open source uh, awareness uh, in, is is what's next plan for the for the alc uh, uh, if you would like to reach to us, uh, just simply send a mail uh, dev at the community dot apache dot org, and please include the ALC prefix in the subject line if you have, if you would like to ask questions related to ALC, so it will help us to figure out if this question is related to ALC. So the respective members who are uh, volunteering or interested in the initiative, they just uh, uh, 
uh, reply to the, your mail. And uh, uh, again, if you like to chit chat with us or have a simple question or would like uh, would like to have some chat with us, uh, you can just uh, join our Slack channel. Uh, go to s dot slash slash invite. From there, you can uh, create your Slack account and uh, please join the ALC channel uh, and post your query there. Please don't uh, post it on other channel because there is a lot of other channels for other project and general channels as well. Uh, to know more about ALC, please feel free to visit to uh, the link as dot apache dot org forward slash ALC. You get you get a lot of a, a big chunk of information how the things look like and uh, to get more details on it i would like to thank uh, a, a huge thanks to all the uh, uh, apache community development team and the board uh, because they really helped us to making sure that we are in the right path and 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 turning an idea into something real it's it's uh, definitely credit, credit goes to uh, uh, the community team and the board for, for the inputs and uh, nothing is possible with the actual members from the ASC chapter. So Beijing, uh, Indoor, Beijing, Borsa, Budapest, Lagos members, thank you so much for, for your hard work and continuous support for this initiative. All, all the things which you are doing is really uh, impacting the, uh, uh, the local region uh, in any very uh, profound way and uh, thanks so much for all your effort. And, and the logo which you have seen, uh, uh, it's thanks to our creative team and special thanks to the Kenneth who built this beautiful logos for, for uh, our Apache Local Community Initiative and Apache Local Community Chapters. So, uh, so that's all from my side. If you'd like to reach to me, uh, I'm available on the Twitter and uh, uh, just simply DM me if I have any, any further question or even after this session, anything related to open source, Apache Software Foundation, community development, and I'm, I'm uh, Apache local community. I'm just there, so don't don't worry about your question as long as it's related to the open source and and, and community uh, or uh, uh, touching any any the other aspect for the community. Please do let me know. I, I will be happy to uh, answer and assist you. So uh, so that's all are uh, from my side. Uh, and uh, yeah, so I I got some comments uh, here. Uh, so. Uh, if you have any question, please feel free to post there and uh, uh, we will be happy to uh, answer those questions. So let me answer some uh, some uh, some more uh, some questions or the comments. So we have uh, so uh, I'm at this open source wave.io is the initiative which I which I'm currently working on uh, on uh, it's just I, I create a lot of stuff related to open source uh, to spread the open source awareness. So it's it, it just uh, uh, the, the link you are posted is related to that. So if you are interested in it, uh, definitely uh, check out the uh, check out the various videos and the content. And if you have any suggestion, would like to see something else uh, related to open source, please do let me know. Technology RSS, I'm from Bangladesh. Hey, uh, welcome. Uh, I'm from India, uh, so we are neighbors. So if you have anything or would like to uh, work on, on uh, uh, anything please please uh, related to ALC uh, please feel free to let's, uh, let us know at the uh, uh, on the mailing list we'll be happy to assist uh, and work on that Turkey Chicago hey uh, hey uh, thanks thanks for joining hi Sharon uh, good to see you uh, uh, Christopher uh, guess we will wait till we actually do other events again yeah definitely Christopher I am I'm also excited for it uh, uh, Emmett uh, uh, Few, few chapter are just established recently, like I mentioned, Lagos. So we are we are working on uh, uh, on it. So rest the list is uh, updated. Uh, would region instead of city also work? So uh, uh, Chris, very nice question. Thanks for putting this. So uh, so the thing is, uh, uh, as long as if if, if that region is uh, enough and manageable, uh, so it's it's it's. There is no right answer, right, direct answer, yes or no. It's depend on what currently region is, uh, and uh, so uh, if, if the region is really very big, and uh, uh, so what we will do is we will uh, we will break it down into the smaller one. But yeah, if if the region is uh, uh, it's is like a small one and uh, and can be manageable, uh, definitely we can we can go for it. So on the case to case basis, we will. 
uh, we will discuss it. And <laughs> yes, Sebastian, <laughs> European region. Cool. So we are more thinking uh, of uh, uh, of the main uh, the greater region around this Frankfurt. So uh, uh, thanks, Christopher. Let's let's connect on it and uh, let's discuss more on it. And uh, we we can definitely more discuss and figure out what will be the right uh, uh, way to go for uh, forward with this region. Hey, Neha. Uh, 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 hey, uh, good to see you from India. Uh, uh, I'm from the Madhya Pradesh, the center part of India. So where are you from? And uh, and if you have any questions or uh, if you'd like to establish something in, 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 in any, any particular region from India, we'll be uh, absolutely happy to assist you. So please do let me know uh, uh, where are you from, particularly from the India. Uh, as, as Sharon mentioned, uh, please feel free to post your questions. I'm, I'm reading it and we'll be able to assist it. William, thank you so much. Yeah, I'm like you. I'm also excited for uh, having more and more ALC chair to establish. Uh, highly appreciate your great contribution towards this initiative. Thank you so much. Uh, Emma, thank you so much. Uh, uh, oh, your question answered during, during this presentation. So thank you so much. So five into a total, right? Uh, thank you, William. Uh, Vibhuti, thank you so much uh, for for uh, for for your yeah, for inputs. Uh, and uh, yeah, uh, you're from Germany, and uh, yeah, uh, uh, yeah, definitely go ahead and uh, uh, go ahead for it. And if if you need any help, uh, please feel free to reach out to me. So uh, uh, over the Twitter or, or or also over the mailing list. I'm 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 uh, available there. Uh, uh, are uh, stationary event returning back from uh, being online? So, uh, uh, so yeah, Yarek, uh, uh, are you talking about the physical events? Uh, uh, or uh, are you asking, is there any, any physical events planned? Yeah, so, uh, so yeah, uh, uh, ALC Indoor is having a, a hackathon planned in, in, uh, Maybe it's uh, in the October, uh, October and uh, or uh, early of November. So they are doing that. And apart from that, uh, 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 things are going well in, in various places. So definitely, I'm I'm also hopeful that more and more uh, physical events will be there soon. So yeah, so uh, yeah, I might plan. So. Oh, super. Super excited for it. Uh, uh, as as a Warsaw, we were doing really great things, and uh, thanks for all your efforts. Uh, so excited for it. Uh, looking forward to it. Cool. Uh, so yeah, yeah, we also have few uh, uh, various submitters from the Germany as well. So uh, definitely, if you if you if you uh, when you post something on the dev list, uh, you will definitely go, uh, going to see some response from the. On the computers as well, and you are from uh, Maharashtra Nagpur. Happy to see that I'm also from the Maharashtra, but I, I am now uh, uh, in the central part of India. Cool. So uh, thanks so much, everyone, uh, for for joining. Uh, I'm I'm still waiting for more questions till uh, till the uh, time is there. And uh, thank you so much for for such a nice audience and asking such beautiful questions. Uh, it's 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 an uh, amazing initiative done from the community and and really happy to see how this is going and a lot of amazing things that had to come because uh, now we 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 are on the track and ready to do some more awesome things so thanks thanks so much for joining and uh, uh, for for uh, your support to the ELC initiative thanks so much Sharon uh, and. Uh, uh, yeah, thanks, thanks so much, Christopher. Sharon, thanks so much. It's a, it's a pleasure to kick off the community track for Apache Khan. And thank you so much for, for helping us uh, uh, to make this event uh, uh, successful in terms of community development and making sure that a lot of things, efforts involved from your side. So I really appreciate in, uh, you and thank you so much for that. Uh, bye, Christopher. See you soon. Uh, we, have, we are connected. So happy to see you. and. Uh, Lot of things in the uh, happening in the Germany as well for the ALC. Bye bye, Shavish Chen. Thank you so much for joining. So, yeah, check in yeah. Thank you.
Cool. So, uh, so we are on time and we wrap up this first session on time. <laughs> right, Sharon? So, so let's wait uh, if, if there are any further questions. Uh, if not, we can definitely wrap up this session. Hey, Sharon, nice to see you. Uh, Sharon, you're not audible. Uh, is, is it my issue or? No, it's me. Sure. Can you hear me now? Yeah, yeah, now you're audible. Yeah, sorry, I didn't get here. I was uh, running around trying to test my uh, audio as well. For, uh, yeah. Like so, so sorry, but uh, but really, thank you for kicking off the, the talk and the track and everything this year. So that's great. No worries. Thank you very much for your help as well in the promotion of uh, the, the tracks and everything as well. So I thought the interviews and everything, so, so great. It was my pleasure, Mince. Uh, I really <laughs> enjoyed that part. And so much of insight from your side was really uh, amazing to listen. So thanks so much for your timing for that. Uh, so we've got, got another fun-filled days of stuff to come. So, so yeah. So what I'm going yeah. to do is I'm going to I'll move over to the next session because I think it's Jim's session, but he might, I think he might have actually done a recording. So I just got to go and check to make sure that all of that will be working. Yeah, yeah, sure, sure. Yeah, well. yeah. So, so, okay. So, great. So have a good conference. <laughs> yeah, same to you. See you, see you around.